Hey guys, Mike and Terry here, back with you on two, two Palette Tuesday. Two Palette Tuesday. Yeah, we're gonna do two, guys. Tidbit Two Palette Tuesday. There's, there, there's all the teas for you guys. Here's your tidbit right here. Your tidbit is we are gonna do two palettes. Two palettes. Here's um, the tidbit right out of the gate. Do not always believe what they say these palettes are. Supposed to be like new. I can tell you what we're going to view today is not like new. No, guys. We're seeing it already. You the guys, bubble has been busted. Yesterday was palette number one with all the umbrellas. You guys saw how that turned out. But today we're going to do palette number two and three of our um, fun, what do we call it? Outdoor fun or whatever. <laughs> Um, I don't know, guys. I don't know how this is going to turn out. <laughs> the six outdoor palette adventure. <laughs> yeah. But remember, no matter what, we're going to keep laughing, guys. Always. What else are and you going to do about it, right? Tomorrow is hump day, and we're going to do the drawing and reveal the winner. And that is awesome right there. Yeah. So, Mike, tell us, or let's see what we got here while I break it down for everybody again. So, if you're new to our channel, you'll understand what's going on. Six palettes, one flat price. Divided the six pallets into what it would be, breaks it down to $566 per pallet. There will be a total of 83 items through these six pallets, which will also be $40.93 per item for each pallet. So let's see how well we're going to do here with this one. Cross our fingers. Because, oh, don't start with that one. We're that just going to get it out of the, the way. I just want to I just want to be done with it, guys. There's one ugly one right, right. there. And he wants to bring out the worst first. We're doing it. Oh, my gosh. Are you kidding me? I have no answers. This is worse than I thought. Let's just feed him pizza. Let's do it. All right, guys. Here All right, it is. what do we got, babe? It's a folding wagon. Do those wheels look like new? Not at all. What really gets me? Is this one? This is what made me laugh. Look at that, guys. Can what you they, see? How? It is so bent that it threw off the whole alignment to where it ground the wheel. It won't even turn. They just like dragged it this and they one, rubbed all the rubber off. Yep. Of, dear so, Lord. This thing has been used, used and, abused. and abused and then some. Is it still usable? I don't know. I mean, if we straighten you that, can't, you, if we straighten that one wheel out, maybe it's slightly usable. No, no, Ew. what the? It's done. It is done. Oh man, guys, that material. Why did they do that to me? And the handle don't lock. This is oh that man. material is so stained and gross looking. You don't know if that's soda or human waste. <laughs> So here's the deal, Mr. Wagon Return Dude. Uh -huh. You return it because it's defective, not because you ruined it. That's the boom button. That really takes a lot of nerve. I All guess. right. Well, guess what, guys? We just moved on to another one. Folding Wagon Chariot. Let's chariot. see real quick what these retail. So we know what we're going to be looking at per item here. You better be looking at least Absolutely. 41 bucks. I accidentally shut it. There we go. It was not factory sealed, guys. These wheels are used. Um, well, I mean, we'll pull it out and look at it. But it's not new. And remember, this is supposed to be like new. So let's see what we're looking at here. It looks cool. Folding... I don't know how you open it. Oh. Oh, this is cool, though, guys. Look at this. So it's like a beach wagon. It's got a retractable handle. You don't have any coffee or anything, No. Do you? I'm so confused. This is cool. I wanted to screenshot this for you guys. But this person who typed this ad on Amazon or something, what, what does that word say, Mike? Folding beach wagon. Oh, they just typoed it. Betch, betch wagon. Betch wagon. They missed the A, guys. Okay. That's all it is. So, $100 this one showing on Amazon. Okay. Okay. Well, so, still. It's sellable. 
Is it sellable? But it is not new, guys. It okay. has, a, has a stain right here on the fabric. The wheels are used. So, I mean, it's this is still a good item, but this is not what we ordered. We ordered like new. That is not like new. The definition for this company for like new is, um, sorry, possible package damage, shelf um, pulls, shelf pulls, unused item though. It said un, it specifically said unused item. So. This is, and you, you do, you pay a lot more for these categories. So that is definitely a heartbreak there. $50. Another one, same thing, guys. Okay. This one, I'm not gonna take it out of the box. I just wanted to show you guys what that looked like. Uh, we gotta go a little bit faster because this is a two pallet. Two pallets. All right. So yeah, we won't take it out. Okay, what are we looking at? Okay, maybe we'll take it out just so we can see the wheels. Because it's in the other way. Used. Okay. Looks to be really clean, though. No visible damage right off. Does have a return. It says used. Didn't like the wheels. Those wheels look awesome to me. Oh, they look what good. are we writing these down for? Fifty. Fifty dollars. Tell me if you want to do something different, though. All right. What's this one? This might be what something I different, stand? guys. This is a brown box. Let me get this one. I just, I hope I didn't. Oh, what do we got here? This is different. I don't know what this is. Some kind of wagon. You ready? Ah! No, it's factory packed. Oh, this is a different one. No, is it factory packed? So these wheels are like super clean. You can tell they've been used. <coughs> this one's in a lot nicer shape. The real it question is, is, a lot nicer shape. did it have a defect? Is that why they sent it back right here? It says, didn't like it. Okay, I'm gonna call that well, as, they tested it, didn't meet their satisfaction, but look how clean these wheels are. But they are, you can tell they have been on the ground. Here, wow. <clears throat> yeah, that's it. I want more of these. Here is a <laughs> screenshot of it. $110 at Target for that one. All right. At Target? At okay. Target that came up. Okay, guys. You know, I think we're still looking at 50 bucks. What do you think? I bet you we could get 60 for that one. But what do you, I mean. Okay. $60. 60 Okay. 60 it is. We want more of those. Let me lift one for you. Okay, you lift Swap one. Swap sides. Where I get a Take drink a break. from my world famous boom mug. Boom. All right, let's see what we got. This one's cut on the bottom. Oh, yeah, it is. But there is still wrapped. Ooh, that one might. Is it brand new? That's not wrapped. It's just got the phone. Packaging. This packaging. It looks like it could be brand new. Let's see the wheels. I'm trying. Those wheels don't look used, guys. This Let's one see. might be brand new. We might have um, hit the big one. It is been opened. Ta-da! Man, I think this one's new, guys. Tags are on. That's yes! still wrapped. Boom! This one is brand new, actually. Woo! Oh, by the way. Huh. Boom! This is what the whole thing's supposed to be. Do it! Boom! <laughs> Okay, seriously. This is what the whole order was supposed to be. All right. So, $75, right? Ba Boom. Okay, I'll go with that. Well, that's what we originally thought we that's were going to That's right, we did. We did. You're right. Because so we do thought they were all going to be new, guys. Let's just do that again. In fact, when the truck driver delivered this order to us, he asked us, he said, how much are you selling those for? He was excited. He was, like, ready to buy one this right then. Folding out right But we told him we had to... Uh, we had to, you know, process them first, so we we didn't sell one. Sealed on the bottom. Um, there is it. This one has been used like maybe once, guys. Excellent condition. Really good condition. Okay. Fifty dollars, sixty dollars. Sixty. Sixty for this one. We're gonna call the truly okay. like new ones sixty. Okay. The used fifty. Fifty. The brand new, brand new seventy-five. 75. Sounds like a good deal. I was deal. looking to see if we saw a sticker on this one. 
It says was used and didn't like it. Sometimes it's just interesting to know the reason what uh, people have. Why why somebody took it back. Oh, oh my man. gosh! What? Oh, you guys aren't gonna believe this! Oh man! We're losing money now, guys, because we're keeping them! <laughs> Holy I have no answer. Mo! You guys aren't even gonna believe Get get out of there! She's peeking in another pallet, you guys! Don't tell me out. I did, I told him. Oh, this one's factory wrapped still! We got another brand new one, guys! Boom! 75 bucks! Boom, I like it! Yes! So, oh, man, I think we're batting about 50 50, though, for the new version. the new one's right there. Okay, is that the new one? That one was new. Okay. That'll make it easier while we're sorting. All right. Yeah. Okay, well, let's get this one out first. Yeah, don't do that. Before, yet. So we don't show yeah, them this yet. Is exciting! Okay, this one says. Didn't like it. I like how they put the stickers on here. Factory sealed on this end. How do they know they didn't like it then? We're going to cut this open. Well, yeah, they probably opened the other end of the box. Let's find out. Just because something says open this end first doesn't Stiff, mean nothing. It is brand new. Look at that. Brand new. How do you not like it? It's brand new. Tags it doesn't have all the packaging, you know, though. Those big pieces of cardboard are missing. I think they took it out. They looked at it. It just wasn't. It might have been too heavy for them. Lift it part way up and see the wheels. Yeah. Brand new. The wheels have dust like they rolled it across their driveway. If and that. then stuck it back in. Um, no, this one's good. I'm going to call this one 75 still. Boom! <laughs> it's going to be too you out. Write these all down? Ah, I will go there. We've done a total of Three, seven. three seventy-fives. We've done a total of seven. Yes, I got them. Okay. Got no, we've done a total of eight. I didn't count that one. Okay. That's zero money. But we've okay, done. Mike. All right, guys. This here is what we go. I'm here goes the fun. About. Here's the here's the fun. I have here's... never seen this before. Look at that. A portable beach. Lounge chair, wagon. But when you something fold it the other way, it's a wagon. I mean, how amazing is this? You know what's gonna happen if oh, you keep man. that? What? The six-year-old grandson's gonna say, "Papa, push me in." No, this is in the beach. No. No. Not doing it. <gasps> Grandma would do it for me. I gotta have. Oh my, my gosh! This eBay seller's oh. crazy. Oh. I thought two hundred and fifty dollars for that. But we don't know. Is that a good price? I don't know. We're gonna do a search on it. What's this thing called? Beach day lounger combo cart. Let's find out, guys. <gasps> this is factory wrapped. I you can't talk. Oh. Try again. Beach day lounger combo cart. We have eBay, eBay, Amazon. I feel a little bit better just going to Amazon. Okay, what's Amazon? Amazon. Um, is that Max Sport? I don't know. Does the picture match up? I think so. I see somebody. All right, guys. Added up. It was 140 down to itself for 88. I see another one for 125, 138, 38, 138. These are all Amazons. So it gives us an idea. I think we can get $80 out $200. of it. $200. No. Yes, it is Mac. Okay. Mac Sports. Okay. So how much do you think? 80 That is factory wrapped in there, guys. Perfect. The plastic hasn't even been torn open. $80, sir. Here's another one, guys. Both ends of the box are open. Sealed. How's the wheels look? Sealed. Factory sealed. Yeah! Boom! Just a smashed box, guys. Boom! Boom! Like it. I gotta like see it a lot. Here. Okay. Man! That's awesome. Nice. That is that's oh, awesome. Oh man, like guys. It. 
Those okay. are going to be good sellers here. Let's roll this. Do you want to tally this pallet up, or do we want to bring in the second pallet? We can, uh, here, I'll tally this up real quick while you you uh, get that loaded. And I'm going to tell them real fast what we got. Okay, well, I get what loaded. I don't know. I don't know what load, you're talking so, about. load something. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> so here we go. All right, guys. Number one. I'm not really wanting to stay up there. Hopefully, it doesn't fall off on us here. Okay. We're not. In... Okay. 566 in on this pallet. Potential sales 605 uh -oh. for this pallet. That's only a $39 profit right there. Uh oh. All right. Uh -oh. So. Okay, so you know what? Pallet. Let's bring in the second pallet, which is like pallet number idea. three, you guys, and we'll be right back. All right, guys, here we go. Pallet number two is in place. So, Mike. All right, guys. There you go. Rip that puppy open. I. Very scary on this, this one. Made the last one look great. This, um. So, wow. don't forget your Tidbit Tuesday. Do not. You know, you always hear don't don't always trust the prices in the manifest. You know, I mean, it could be human error. It could have been they just titled this wrong, labeled this whole lot wrong. There's no way though that this lot was a like new condition. I'm really. I just cut the straps, guys, and the whole thing just tipped shifted. over. Luckily, our wagons are holding it up. I really think that when they were putting this into the system that they, um, they just, they aired it and oh. did not, oh gross, oh my gosh. So, I think we mentioned it yesterday in the video for the umbrellas that we said we had one coming up that has a bunch of something that when we would get them in storage units, it always scared us. I think we're about to see that same scenario right now. I'm stuck in a corner. This is an igloo wheeled cooler. These are actually really nice coolers too, guys. Um, I think you can probably see the nastiness. So on the other end. I mean, this thing is gross. This has been used so much, the wheels have no tread left on them anymore. Um, definitely not like new. Do we even risk it? Let's do it. You know now what? Now you do it so I can run. We're gamblers. We're risk takers. I'm going to do it, guys. I'm sure it's empty, but it's probably disgusting. It's, it is. It's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. You guys can see in there. Oh, my gosh. The tray fell out. Hit the camera. Sorry, guys. Um, this is. I mean, with some elbow grease, this is sellable. But in all reality, this is like a $20 used cooler. Yeah. Not what we are hoping for. So I'll tell you why we cringe with coolers. We have actually opened up coolers in storage lockers that would have food and I'm talking like not canned food no refrigerator freezer you guys, food or we have vegetables. opened them and they have been full of critters that creepy were crawl crawlies out that were disgusting it was in the oh. smells and the liquid I mean I, I don't want to it is bad it was bad okay guys so twenty dollars this one appears to be like maybe it's never been used well, we have a problem here. I think you guys can probably see that wheel is severely bent. <laughs> Maybe it can be fixed. I don't know. Um, we you usually... guys like the effort I tried to even think I could even try to do it? And it has been used. There are food crumbs in here. We usually get about $40 out of this size of cooler. It's like a 60-core so, rolling with the handle. These does are, it roll at all? Well, no. Have you ever tried to drive your, <laughs> your, your car when it looks like that? It's just not going to work. So if I can straighten that out, guys, we'll sell this for probably about 40 bucks if it will straighten out. Okay, if not, the cooler is still functional. $20? With the bent wheel? 
Yeah. Probably 15. Okay. See, I got that it. will really turn people off. That's going to. Because that the, is more or less put it on your patio, then fill it with ice so you're not having to go in and out of your house. The to desirability get your of those coolers is because of that portability. Correct. Portability. So I'm going to put it down for $15. It's probably going to be a loss, but let's give it a try, right, Mike? Let's see, can I help you lift something? You oh. want to go for this one? No, I want this one right here. All right. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Oh, man, guys. It's a heavy. Oof. I'm not in your way. My table's up. That man. Oh. All right, guys. Spin it around. I want to show them what it looks okay. like. Okay. So this is a, what's it called? A, you guys can read it. Savaro. This is a roto-molded cooler. Most of you probably realize what those are, like Yeti, Grizzly, those type of coolers. Fancy. Way higher quality. They hold ice a lot longer. They're also really heavy. Um, yeah, it has the handle, has the wheels, it's used, says it was the wrong size. You bought it, you know. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I can understand if you order it online, but if it's been used. Look at that, guys. That's fancy. That's cork. I'm going to show you the inside. Can you see me? Um, I looked these up before we filmed this video, Wait, you guys. Open. It's cracked. That's okay. That's going to take some of the value out, but it's still, this, this cooler still has value. I was going to look it up. Okay. Or do you already have it ready? I looked this up, you guys, and it was all, kind of all over the place. There's one company selling them online for $135 with free shipping. Uh, beyond that, it's pretty much all third party sellers. And. They were about 360 bucks. I'm going to say with all the scratches all over it, you can see the top, the crack in it. I'm going to say we're probably looking at around, I don't know, $60. I think 60 because the crack on top will still be functional, right? Correct. That's just okay. cosmetic. We're going to see how much of the dirt we can get cleared off of this. Other than that, the inside that I could see looked good, that we could all see looked good. So, $60? We're going to call it 60 We're going to try 60 And then we're going to cross our fingers, guys. Why are we crossing our fingers? You got your fingers crossed? Okay. See, remember as a child, you just wouldn't cross those. You'd cross those, and you, then you would even cross those. I mean, that was just crazy. Ta-da! There's another one in the box. Now we're hoping, because this is a like new palette, guys. <laughs> we're hoping. <laughs> well, considering how it's taped up. Okay. It does have the factory packaging in here. But. But what I'm immediately noticing. But let's what? Put it what down. are you doing? Let's put it on the ground. Okay. What I'm immediately noticing is on that one over there, it had plastic wrap protective coverings. I'm not seeing that on this one. Let's see what we got here. Okay, ready? Yeah, I got it. Wow, guys, these even come in a fabric carrying case. I mean, that tells you the quality level of these. Ooh, I think it's been used, though. I think it's been used. Turn it around. I do believe it's been used. There is no instruction booklet or nothing inside it. Um, in fact, the book's not even in, it's no, in the it's box. It's in the box. You know, I think maybe on this one would be maybe you looking at um, 80 bucks. All right. What do you think? I think it's really fancy. These are really nice. I like it. And I'm, 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 uh, you're wanting to say that for our road trips, aren't you? I know you are. You guys, when you watched our fun Friday a couple weeks ago when we went on a road trip to Reno, you saw me loading up our luggage. And I loaded up that little blue cooler. That little blue cooler is a roto molded cooler like this. And when we fill it up with 10 drinks and all the ice, the thing weighs like 70 pounds. And we love it. It holds ice really good. But I'm kind of thinking that this whole uh, wheel thing. Wait. 
Look at this. However, oh, it's got plastic wrap on it. I'm kind of thinking this is a... And you know what else? Don't tell me about the gold. I already knew you were going to say it. I already knew, guys. I know this. That's it. And cork, because they own a winery down there. Okay. Perfect. Done. So, how much? Did you say? 80? I think that we'll get around 80 okay. out of this one. Because this one's pretty close to like me. I'm going to still put it down as 80. So what I'm thinking, put those there. For my own purpose, guys. His own purpose. That's good. Enough. Because we're not going to get very much out of that that other one, that I might clean that one up really nice and keep that one and sell that little blue one that we already own. Mike's keeping something? I'm going to trade it out. But hold on. Mike wants to keep something else. Mike's wanting to keep a few things. Now this is just a interesting oh. scenario. So remember guys, like new, this is a patio box cooler. One, two, three legs. These retail one hundred dollars. Wait, what's Wait. rattling in there? Let's check it. Ready? Okay. I was looking to. I can't stand it up. It'll stand. Have you ever seen a three-legged cat? How do you open? Oh, this is so, one of these. There's the. It's leg. in there, you guys. It's a miracle. Okay, let's flip it back over. So these are, they call this a, what's it called? A cooler bar? Table and cooler combo. You guys it's a have seen, bar. You guys have seen us get some of these before. They've been like round ones. They're usually round, the ones we've gotten before. They sell instantly. So I'm pretty excited about so, this. So online, you can sit there and pay for these anywhere from $100 to a couple of hundred dollars. I believe we got $75. So, I here. believe we do too. Is that so, fit in there? I mean, where it's, it snapped it back in. It is broken. It is. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull this screw out of here and just put a washer there, and I'll be able to put that leg right back on. Perfect. Not a problem at all. 75 bucks. Love it. Hey. Boom! Yes! Hey, you know it's not a huge profit, but another reason why I went for these six pallets, I knew, as I said at the very first video, is there's not going to be a lot of profit zone in this. But this was going to be easy, easy sells. This was going to be, it's summertime. These items are in demand. They're going to sell fast. And they're it's, like new. <laughs> and let's, allegedly. let's, allegedly, there you go, April, allegedly. Let's just, um, you know, turn and burn these real quick. And well, allegedly, they are supposed to be like new, like All right. Mike says. $100. Here's $100. Says it was returned because it falls with weight. Just like that. Okay, so put it back up. I, I don't know if you're technically supposed to put drinks on it. Well, it says it's a table. Well, maybe if you lock oh, it. Oh, you got a lock. It's got locks. Go ahead. It doesn't fall. I got the world famous boom mug on here. It does not fall. I'm pushing on it. Boom. They did not have it locked into place. All right. There we go. That was operator error, you guys. Watch this. Push the little locks in or push down on a little bit. Don't smash my arm. Okay, here, you do one. No, you're scaring me. Send it to the side. You're going to hurt me. I know it. See, that doesn't fall on its own. Oh. Okay, so. Another 75. 75. That one was the 80. That was a 75. Here's another 75. Okay, guys. All right. So now we got a problem. This is a big problem, you guys. Let me help Mike get this up here. Are we ready? Should we try to, let's just, we're not going to turn it over. Let's bring no. it up just the way it is. Ready? Nope. Go get I'm it. going yep. by the handle. Ready? Yep. So this is upside down, guys. We're going to leave it this way because um, the frame is all falling apart. It, and it's not because it's broken. The screws are literally backed out this far. So this well, one's completely missing. Let me tell you what we got here because you're seeing the back side of it on top of it. This is a Tommy Bahama cooler. A 
It's a deck, cart. It's a deck cooler. It's a deck cooler. So it's like a cart with a built-in cooler inside here. This is the front over here. Has a bottle opener, which is looks like it has ketchup on it. This is um, a this is the little thing that the caps would bottle caps would fall into. Which is dirty. It's, I mean, it's this dirt, is, it's dirty. This dirty. is very used, this you is, guys. Yes. The casters I'm, are all rusty. I am curious. Lay it. Flip it over one time. Okay. Flip Let's, it over. We're going to try to open up the top here still. Ready? Sorry for the view you get okay, there. Okay, guys. Here Let's we go. Let's see. Oh boy. What this looks like. So the the writing is the Tommy Bahama writing. Ooh, it comes with the cover. Has, has the sailfish. It's definitely used. Cleanable, but will never be like new. No, not even close. Not even. You, guys. Um, you know, it's got a little bit of rust marks in it. Uh, but it is, it's cleanable, and it is, with some repairs, it's usable. This, there's a owie on the wood there. This is Definitely should have been sold in the used category. Oh, for sure. By far. By far. So, can, so, I, ask, can I ask you a question? What's up? Are we selling this? When I saw this come off the truck, you guys, and I saw that it was all busted up and falling apart, I thought, how much money are we going to really get out of this? So I told her, I said, we're going to repair it, and we're just going to keep it, because we've actually kind of wanted one of these for our patio, but... It's just us. I am always just too cheap to um, buy one. Cheap, cheap, cheap. So there is a dent in the handle over here. That may have happened in shipping. Let Who me knows? do a voice search. Tommy Bahama wooden deck cooler. That ought to find it. Should. Let's find out. Go. Go, 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 go. And whoa. Amazon. Oh, different yeah. color. Different color, though. Amazon, 750 for that one. What? Um, this isn't no seven hundred and fifty dollars. Here's cooler. ours. Who is that guy selling that? No, this is a couple of years old. This don't help. All us. right. So. Um, oh, and it's a little swollen right here. The wood. Oh, this has been wet on top, you guys. Four hundred and fifty. Is that the same? That's not even the same one. Never mind. Pretty much these wooden ones. Here's. These wooden ones are like four fifty to. Well, here's a screenshot, but it doesn't have a price, so that doesn't help us any either. So, um, just say four fifty and up for these wooden ones. Okay, I'm gonna say, go for. at best, with the condition it's in, after repairs, it, I can't believe we could get more than a hundred dollars for it. I was gonna, I was gonna call out one fifty. See you what think you said. I want, I, no, I just wanted to think if we were on the same page. I'm just curious so about what do you, you think? hundred? Know, because of this dent and. It's not broken though. These are just screws. This okay. is easily repaired. Hundred dollars. Okay, hundred dollars. It is. All right. Hundred dollars. Okay. All right. So, well, well, uh, I really do want to keep it. I mean, we don't really need it, um, but we've been in the process. You guys have seen our cabana from last year. Um, we've been setting up our new patio furniture this year, and we're trying to, you know, we're going with the tropical theme. And I feel like this would fit in really well with what we're doing. But it would. I guess we got to decide, you know, by the time we hit day number, well, the last day of, of these six pallets, is there any money to be made? Let me tell you where we're at on this one. Okay, where are we at on this one? This one's, this was going to be our worst one here, unfortunately. I figured because it, it only have had been, a handful of items. It was supposed to be our most profitable one, and it's actually going to be our worst one. Um, all, uh, each pallet, $566, potential sales, $455, a negative of 141 And that's counting selling this cooler for $100. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This pallet only had seven items, guys. So if we broke it down, I want to break it down. Okay. What's seven times 41? I want seven to know. Seven times forty-one. Seven times forty-one. Oh. So if we if we did two eighty-seven. If we did break it down to what we paid for just this one pallet, mm -hmm. if we broke it down that way, it would have been two eighty-seven. So technical or two eighty-one. So technically, we would have made it, but we're doing this as a whole lot because we don't know how many items is in each pallet. 
Yeah, what he just said. What he just so, said. There we go, guys. <laughs> just remember what he said, guys. All right. <laughs> we appreciate you hanging in there for the Two Pallet Tuesday. And remember that tidbit, guys. Just because they say it's one kind of condition does not mean that is your condition. Holy smokes, and that is true. Luckily, this company that we are working with supposedly are really good with the claims. We have not filed a claim with them yet. So we are going to find out how well this is going to work for us. We're three pallets in, guys, and so far um, none of them have been like new nope, pallets. No. Nope. So, so well, we're going to find out. We'll see you tomorrow for hump day, for our big Good. drawing, the, the, the winner announcement, hey, and we'll see. Give them give a sneak voice. Mark, 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 mark. We'll see. Uh, hey, Linda. Linda? Hey, Julie. <laughs> Julie. Oh, man. So we'll see you tomorrow whether that palette is like me. <laughs> All right, guys. Take care, everybody. Of course, right. keep laughing. Bye. Bye-bye.